Hi, Cancer. This is a peek at your partner for the week of March the 5th through March the 11th, 2023. Universal energies. Show me what I need to see for the star sign of Cancer's partner for March the 5th through March the 11th, 2023. Universal energies. Show me what I need to see. For the partner of the star sign of Cancer for March the 5th through March the 11th, 2023. Universal energies, show me what I need to see. For the partner of the star sign of Cancer for March the 5th through March the 11th, 2023. Show me. You guys, subscribe, like, comment, and share these videos. If this does not resonate with you, check your moon, rising, and Venus sign videos. I do not read reversals. So, Cancer. Cancer, these are your cards, honey. This is a peek at your partner. Your partner has the moon. Your partner has the five of swords. Your partner has the eight of wands. Your partner has strength. And your partner has the six of cups. So, Cancer, your partner has the moon. Could be dealing with a Pisces, but the moon symbolizes secrets or things that are not yet known. It can symbolize moodiness, depression, vivid dreams, deep emotions, intuition, but secrets. So listen, Cancer, could be dealing with a Pisces, but your partner could tell me that they're in the dark concerning something. Your partner could tell me that they're using their intuition or there's a secret. Clarify the moon for Cancer's partner. Clarify the moon for Cancer's partner. Clarify the moon for Cancer's partner. It is clarified with the Seven of Wands. Aries, Leo, or Sag. This is your partner being defensive. They're on the defense. But this can also speak to your partner being put in a position where they're having to defend themselves against rumors, gossip, and other people's opinions. Now, this can be your partner shunning someone, fighting someone off, setting boundaries with someone. But this is also an accusatory card. So your partner could be being accused of some type of rumors and gossip, and they're giving their defense or excuse here. So listen, Cancer, your partner could tell me that they're standoff is shunning and setting boundaries with you, or they're trying to come in and explain, give that explanation, excuse, or defense here. So, Cancer, listen, you know, your partner could tell me that some type of secret came out and their standoff is shunning and setting boundaries with you. Your partner could tell me that a secret came out and they're coming in trying to explain, give the explanation, excuse, or defense here, okay? You know, your partner could also tell me that, you know, it's an element of the unknown on whether or not they should come in and explain, give the explanation, excuse, or defense, using their intuition here or whether or not they should. Cancer, your partner has the five of swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is tit for tat, tug of war. One up in one another. Snide remarks, having the last say. Speaking ill of one another behind each other's back. Backstabbing one another. This is playing mind games, ego tripping, trying to win at all costs. A bunch of mind games and manipulation. So listen, Cancer, your partner could tell me that you guys had this tit for tat, tug of war, toe to toe going on. Could be some form of mind games and manipulation. However, your partner could tell me that they're pissed and they have an axe to grind here. Clarify the five of swords for Cancer's partner. Clarify the five of swords for Cancer's partner. Clarify the five of swords for Cancer's partner. It is clarified with you, Cancer, the chariot. 
So your partner is determined to move forward confidently, victoriously, successfully ahead. Now this can speak to travel. This can speak to relocating cities, states, countries. This can speak to moving from one residence to another or simply moving forward and leaving things behind. But your partner is determined to move forward confidently. But Cancer, this is you. Clarify the chariot for Cancer's partner. Clarify the chariot for Cancer's partner. What does Cancer's partner think of Cancer? What does Cancer's partner think of Cancer? Clarify the chariot for Cancer's partner. It is clarified with the Four of Pentacles. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is you holding back, holding off, keeping something close to your chest. Now, this is also a card of a miser, a penny pincher, someone who's holding back their coins, saving their money, being stingy, someone who's closed off, locked off, not opening up. So, Cancer, listen, I asked what does your partner think of you? Your partner may think that you're closed off, locked off, not opening up. Your partner may think that you're holding on to your coins, saving your money, being stingy, or you're keeping something close to your chest here, okay? Now, because of the tip for tat, tug of war, toe to toe, yes, you may be closed off to them. But when it comes to you, they may be pissed because you guys did have this tip for tat, tug of war, toe to toe going on, and they may be closed off to you. <clears throat> they may be kind of standoffish and closed off to you here. So let's see. Cancer, <clears throat> your partner has the Eight of Wands, Aries, Leora, Sag. This can indicate that things are happening quickly. This can speak to travel, but this is the fast, rapid moving energy of communicating back and forth over the airways, the internet, with text messages, messenger, WhatsApp, emails, phone calls, even face-to-face -face communication. But this is also the fast, rapid moving energy of being intimate. So listen, Cancer, your partner could tell me that something is happening quickly here. This could involve travel. You guys could have gotten into a heated discussion or argument throwing fiery dots at one another. Or someone was communicating passionately online with someone else or being intimate with someone else. Clarify the eight of wands for Cancer's partner. Clarify the eight of wands for Cancer's partner. Clarify the eight of wands for Cancer's partner. It is clarified with the Eight of Pentacles. <clears throat> Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is mastering their craft, perfecting their skills, trades, and abilities. This is your partner throwing themselves into their work. But this can also speak to them being willing to work on it or put in the work. So, Cancer, listen, you know, this could all be work or business, yes? Your partner could tell me that they're working on something, planning something, or they're willing to work things out, willing to put in the work here. So listen, I mean, was the argument over work or business? Hmm. Your partner could tell me that you guys had some type of heated discussion or argument throwing fiery dots at one another, but they may be willing to work things out here after some type of standoffish an argument here. Let's see. Cancer, your partner has strength. Could be dealing with a Leo, but the universe is calling for your partner to have strength, courage, determination, motivation to keep moving forward and to do the right thing. But this is also a card of your partner trying to tame their lusts, tame their passions, trying to restrain themselves, restrict themselves and hold themselves back from something. So cancer could be dealing with a Leo. But your partner could tell me that they're feeling extremely weak here. Your partner could tell me that they're restraining themselves, restricting themselves, and holding themselves back, or trying to muster the strength and courage to do something. Clarify strength for Cancer's partner. Clarify strength for Cancer's partner. Clarify strength for Cancer's partner. It is clarified with the Two of Pentacles. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is juggling. Now, this could be juggling two ideas. Should I, shouldn't I? Will I, won't I? This could be your partner managing many things at once, weighing up the pros and the cons, or juggling two relationships. So, Cancer, listen, your partner could tell me that they're weighing things up, trying to decide should they, shouldn't they? Or juggling was taking place here. Now, your partner could tell me that they're feeling extremely weak because the secret is that juggling was taking place here. And you guys had this back and forth, tip to tat, tug of war, toe to toe going on. Someone could be juggling with someone that they work with or do business with here. And your partner could tell me that they're feeling extremely weak because of it. However, your partner could be debating here, okay, whether or not to come in and work things out, trying to muster the strength and courage to do so after some type of falling out that you guys had. 
Cancer. <clears throat> Your partner has a six of cups. Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is someone from their past. Flashback from the past. Full-fledged in the flesh. Someone from their past is back. Now, they could be reminiscing on someone from their past, remembering someone from their past, but something or someone from the past is being revisited. This is twin flame energy. This is reconciliation energy. So listen, Cancer, you very well could be this person from their past. They're having feelings of nostalgia, wanting to reunite. Your partner could tell me that someone from their past is in the picture. Someone from your past is in the picture. Something from the past is being brought back up here. Or this involves children. Clarify the Six of Cups for Cancer's partner. Clarify the Six of Cups for Cancer's partner. Clarify the Six of Cups for Cancer's partner. It is clarified with the Ace of Wands. Aries, Leo, or Sag. This is a brand new, passionate, creative endeavor. Now, this can be the spark of a new idea. This can be some type of exciting, passionate communication, exciting, passionate action. But this one is symbolic of the male phallic and using the male phallic to be intimate. So brand new, passionate beginnings. So listen, Cancer, your partner could tell me that they have the spark of a new idea. Could be initiating something here. This can be passionate communication, romantic passion, or a heated discussion or argument, or starting a passionate new beginning. So listen, Cancer, your partner could tell me that this falling out is because someone dealt with someone from their past. They had a passionate new beginning with someone else juggling. Your partner could tell me that you guys had this heated discussion or argument over something that happened in the past that is being brought back up here now, some type of secret that has you guys going back and forth with one another. However, your partner could tell me, you know what? Yes, yes, I must have the strength and courage to come in to try to work things out and... We're reuniting here and starting this passionate new beginning. Cancer, this is a peek at your partner for the week of March the 5th through March the 11th, 2023. You guys, give me feedback. Subscribe, like, comment, and share. And follow me on Twitter at Her Immortal Maj, M-A-J. And I'll see you guys next week. Peace.